Can you break down the raw travel day? So let's say you're doing a show in Orlando, Florida. Mm -hmm. You live here in California. Yes. So you have to travel. What does that look like? Uh, I typically leave my house Sundays at some point, whether that's an early morning flight or sometimes I'll take a red eye, which uh, has definitely negative consequences towards my sleep. But uh, yeah, head to wherever the show is. Um, we have a call time where we have to get to work. And sometimes I'll show up hair and makeup ready. Sometimes I'll have the makeup artist at work do it. That's and at then, your own choice. Yes. Yeah. Um, and then I typically like doing it more so now because then I can get straight to filming. So um, sometimes, you know, we'll start with, uh, you know, they'll start recording the second that you get to the arena. At what point do you start stealing cookies? <laughs> um, I've tried to limit my cookie intake <laughs> in the last couple months because it's gotten really out of hand. Like we were tallying 12 cookies every Monday or every Friday, depending on which show I was on. And they're just they're addictive. They are. They're like the perfect combination of like crunchy on the outside and gooey in the middle. Still like the cookie dough consistency. Is it the same catering at every show? Mm -hmm. Yeah. They have a, a touring catering company. Oh, that's so mm -hmm. cool. And is it lunch and dinner? It's they bring out different meals throughout the day. There's definitely something once crew gets there because the, the setup the people who are setting up everything need to eat as well. Right. Um, and then when our Call time rolls around. There's typically a lunch out, lunch option, and then closer to showtime, there's dinner as well. So when you get there, are you? Go, is there a locker room for the female talent? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then you go there, you put your stuff down, you get ready. Yep. Oh wow. Yeah. And then are you, who are you trying to TikTok with? Uh, well, it was Dakota Kai for a very long time when I was on SmackDown, and we just got separated. So Maxine and I do a lot of TikToks together. Chelsea and I, um, I've done a few with Our Truth. And then uh, Rhea Ripley is someone that I TikTok with quite frequently. Yes, I yeah. noticed you TikTok with her yes. a lot. Yes, yeah. 